<coughs> Barak the Yahweh, Barak the Yahweh Shai, Barak the Yahweh, Barak the Yahweh Shai, Barak the Yahweh, Barak the Yahweh Shai, Barak the Yahweh, Barak the Yahweh Shai. We give all praises, honors, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Akakwadash. Double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Salutation to the hopeful elect scattered throughout the four corners, pushing his word in truth and sincerity. Okay, Yahweh is the true name of the Heavenly Father. And Yahweh Shai is the true name of the only begotten Son. Yahweh in the Hebrew means he to be, he exists, he is, man. And Yahweh Shai means he delivers, he saves, he's salvation. The Hebrew is very direct and straight to the point, man. Okay? And those are the true names of the Heavenly Father and the Son. Not God or um, Jesus Christ, man. Okay? I want to get into um, a quick lesson on, um, you know, just, Lord willing, this is just, this is just an edifying lesson, man. Um, this is 1 Samuel 2 and 2. There is none holy as the Most High, for there is none beside thee, neither is there any rock like our power. That's right, man. The Most High is by himself, man. Ain't no power greater than the Creator. Okay. Verse three, talk no more exceeding proudly. Let not your arrogance come out of your mouth for the most high is a power of knowledge and by him actions are way. That's right, man. Don't, you can't be proud, man. You can't be proud, man. Because the scriptures tell you, man, you know, pride cometh before destruction, man. Okay. You, you've had... You've had plenty of men who's been in this truth. And some of them, you know, the ones who don't got proud and thought they was a shit, wanted to be the top dog, wanted to be the leader of Israel. Where they at now, man? Okay? They not here because they wanted to be proudful, man. Okay? And that whole pride shit got to go. You can't be a man of the Lord and be proud, man. Okay? You got to always remain humble, man. No matter how much the Most High blesses you with, with wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of the scriptures, you must remain humble, man. Okay. Because at the end of the day, we're still not, we're still, we're still in our captivity, man. Ain't nothing to be proud about. Okay. No, I mean, ain't nothing to be prideful about. Now, it's a good thing to be proud to know that you are of the nation of Israel, that you're out there doing the work, work of the Heavenly Father. But don't, but don't turn being proud of coming in the truth to you being prideful thinking you hot shit okay because the most high is going to judge you man because the scriptures tell you man pride coming before destruction yeah you you have that prideful spirit on you you're gonna you know most likely you know <coughs> Salakia, fall out this truth you got to remember that it's the heavenly father this is his show and we're just his uh, characters doing the work man ain't no other power beside him and we got to always remember that, man. We can't keep thinking, oh, pff, you know, that we're the most high. That's wicked, man. This is... This is Isaiah 45 and 5. I am the most high, and there is none else. There is no power beside me i girded thee though thou has not known me that's right man ain't no other power besides the hawa bahashem yahweh shai man okay the most high is telling you man yahweh is telling you ain't no other power beside him man he's the only one they that may know me from the rising of the sun and from the west that there is none beside me i am yahweh and there is none else that's right, man. From the north, south, east, or west, it's only Yahweh, man. Yahweh, man. The creator, man. The heavenly father. Ain't no other power beside him, man. We got to remember that, man. Everything we do is of Yahweh, Hashem, and Yahweh Shai, man. Okay? It says, you know, according to the scripture, it says a man's going is of the Lord, man. Everything we do, everything we say, because the most I want us to say it. The most I want us to do it. But that doesn't give us the license to sin according to the scriptures, man. Okay, if we're going off, we got to beg for forgiveness. Sigh and cry unto Yahweh Hashem Yahweh for forgiveness, man. Okay, to beg the Most High to put the Spirit of on you 
to um be forgiven and to forgive and be truth and sincere, man. And to know that he's the one and only true power, man. Okay? It says, verse 7, I form the light and I create darkness, man. That's right, man. Night and day. The Most High does that. Okay? I make peace and I create evil. The Most High brings joy, happiness, laughter, love, relief, comfort. And he also brings pain, anguish, death, destruction, torture, grievous things, man. I, the Most High, do all these things. No other power does this. Buddha don't do this. Freaking them other, you know, whatever, or whatever them other false idols are, they don't do nothing, man. But just sit there as a fucking statue and just be there, man. They don't do nothing, man. The Most High does everything, man. And we got to remember that, man. Okay? So, for any Akiyong that's feeling prideful or get a little too prideful, the scriptures tell you, man, examine Examine thyself, man. Study to show thyself approved, man. You got to get that pride demon off of you and humble yourself and just do the work, man. Do the work, okay? I want to give all praises, honors, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakar Kodash. Double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Salutation to the hopeful elect scattered throughout the four corners, doing this work in truth and sincerity. Shalom.